and welcome to our show. All this talk on social media about human rights. And you know the strangest thing about it is, I don't understand how the United Nations, the U.S. State Department, and the House of Lords have been duped by all these human rights activist reports. Do they verify the material that's presented to them? It sure doesn't seem that way. I'm going to point out to you a few of the many instances that have occurred here in Bahrain where the human rights activists have clearly not reported what has actually happened. And I want you to take a look at them as well. And you'll come to the same conclusion that I've come to. They are not reporting accurately. Let's start with what really happened at Salmonia Medical Complex. Here's the video. You take a look. Now that you've seen the video, have any of the human rights activists condemned that criminal activity? Silence. And what about the patients? What about the little girl that was turned away because she was Sunni? Did we hear any of the human rights activists condemn this? Again, silence. Did any of the human rights activists condemn the brutal attack on Khaled al-Sardi? I want you to take a look at this video, and I'm sure you'll come to the same conclusion.
now that you've seen the video, did you have the same question that I had? What about Khaled Arsardi's human rights? Doesn't he have human rights? Did the human rights activists condemn brutal attack? Again, silence. Another victim, a young man who died due to an explosion hidden inside tires. He went out to remove those tires. His concern was for his fellow citizens in Bahrain. Did we hear any of the human rights activists condemn this? Again, silence. <laughs>
So I turn it back to you, the United Nations, the U.S. State Department, and the House of Lords. Just who do you represent? I hope your answer is for the people, not just for power. If you are truly honorable, then you would be honorable for all. Please stay tuned for our next episode, a subject that's near and dear to my heart, the brave men and women of the Bahrain police. Good night.